Have you ever wondered why some men prefer solitude over socializing? Why they seem to operate on a different wavelength altogether? In the complex world of social dynamics, we often hear about alpha and beta males, each with their distinct characteristics and behaviors. But there's another category that's less talked about, but equally intriguing, the sigma males. These are the lone wolves, the introverted mavericks who don't conform to societal norms. They walk to the beat of their own drum, often misunderstood due to their unique preferences and behaviors. Sigma males are enigmatic, operating on a different plane from the rest of us. They don't seek the limelight like alphas, nor do they seek validation like betas. They are comfortable in their own skin, and that's what sets them apart. In this exploration, we are going to delve into the eight uncommon things that only Sigma males like. First on our list is a preference for solitude over social gatherings. Now, this might lead you to presume that Sigma males are inherently antisocial, but allow me to clarify this is not the case. Sigma males are not antisocial, they're selectively social. They are quite capable of socializing and mingling, but they simply choose not to engage in it for the sake of it. For Sigma males, social interactions are not about quantity, but quality. They would rather have a handful of meaningful conversations than be part of a large, noisy gathering. They value deep, significant interactions that stimulate their intellect and allow for genuine connection. They are not the kind to indulge in small talk or superficial banter. It's not that Sigma males don't appreciate the company of others. They do but they also understand the value of their alone time. They see solitude as an opportunity for self-reflection, introspection and personal growth. It's their time to recharge, to delve into their thoughts, to explore their interests and to simply be with themselves. For Sigma males, solitude is not a sign of loneliness, but a sanctuary. It's their sacred space where they can be their authentic selves, away from societal expectations and pressures. It's their haven where they can let their minds wander and their spirits soar. In a world that is constantly buzzing with noise, where everyone is rushing to be a part of the crowd, Sigma males choose to walk a different path. They choose solitude over social gatherings, not because they're antisocial, but because they understand the profoundness that solitude brings. They understand that in the quietude of solitude, one can hear the whispers of their soul. One can find answers to their deepest questions and one can truly connect with their inner self. So the next time you come across someone who prefers solitude over social gatherings, remember they might just be a Sigma male enjoying their sanctuary. For Sigma males, solitude is not loneliness, but a sanctuary. Next up, Sigma males lean towards a minimalist lifestyle. In an era where consumerism is often celebrated, Sigma males take a different path. They gravitate towards a minimalist lifestyle, finding beauty and simplicity and functionality. It's not about austerity, but rather the deliberate choice to own less, to strip away the superfluous and focus on what truly matters. Sigma males aren't charmed by the latest trends or the shiniest gadgets. They do not derive their worth from material possessions. Instead, they understand that the desire for more can often lead to a never-ending cycle of discontent. They prefer to live a life free of clutter, both physically and mentally. For a Sigma male, a minimalist lifestyle is not just about having fewer things in the house. It extends to their thoughts, relationships and commitments. They understand that by reducing the noise around them, they can focus on what's truly important and meaningful. Sigma males value quality over quantity. They invest in things that last, things that serve a purpose. They are not swayed by the allure of fast fashion or disposable items. They'd rather have a few good things that serve them well and last a long time than a house full of items that will be discarded in a year or two. They find satisfaction in owning less, in knowing that they have exactly what they need and nothing more. They appreciate the freedom that comes with a minimalist lifestyle. The freedom from the desire to acquire, the freedom from the stress of managing numerous possessions. And it's not just about physical possessions. Sigma males apply the minimalist principle to their time and energy as well. They are selective about the commitments they take on, the relationships they nurture, and the pursuits they engage in. 
They understand that time and energy are finite resources, and they choose to invest them wisely. In the end, the minimalist lifestyle of a Sigma male isn't about deprivation. It's about intentionality, contentment, and freedom. It's about understanding what truly matters in life and making space for it. In the world of Sigma males, less is indeed more. Thirdly, Sigma males have a penchant for self-learning. They are the quintessential autodidacts. For them, the world is a vast library and every experience a unique book. They are constantly seeking knowledge, not from traditional classrooms or textbooks, but from the world around them. Sigma males are curious beings. They are not content with the surface-level understanding that comes from casual conversations or skimming through articles. They dive deep into the ocean of knowledge, not afraid to get lost in its vastness. Their thirst for understanding is unquenchable, and their hunger for wisdom insatiable. Sigma males are not just consumers of knowledge, but also creators of it. They don't just read and absorb information, they question, analyze and interpret it. They are not followers, but trailblazers, carving their own unique paths in the wilderness of intellect. They are not bound by traditional methods of learning. They do not wait for knowledge to be handed down to them, they seek it out. This self-learning approach allows them to be flexible and adaptable, to learn at their own pace, and to focus on areas that truly interest them. Autodidacticism for Sigma males is not just about academic knowledge, it is about personal growth and self-improvement. They use their learning to better understand themselves and the world around them. They use it to challenge their beliefs, to broaden their perspectives, and to evolve as individuals. Sigma males are not interested in learning for the sake of impressing others or to earn accolades. They do not seek validation from others for their knowledge. Their learning is a personal journey, an intimate dance with wisdom that enriches their souls and sharpens their minds. In a world that often equates learning with formal education and academic degrees, Sigma males challenge this notion. They show us that learning is a lifelong journey, a journey that is deeply personal and profoundly transformative. They remind us that the true value of knowledge lies not in the certificates and degrees it can earn, but in the growth and evolution it can inspire. Sigma males take the adage, knowledge is power, quite seriously. They embody this philosophy in their relentless pursuit of wisdom and their unwavering commitment to self-improvement. Contrary to popular belief, Sigma males are non-competitive. Now, this might seem odd, considering that we live in a world where competition is not just encouraged, but often seen as the driving force behind success. But here's the thing. Sigma males dance to a different beat. While others might thrive on the adrenaline of competition, Sigma males believe in focusing on their own journey. They're not interested in keeping up with the Joneses or climbing the social ladder. Instead, they're more invested in their own personal growth and achievements. They measure success not by comparing themselves with others, but by their own standards. They set their own goals, chart their own course, and are content to progress at their own pace. This doesn't mean that Sigma males lack ambition or drive. Quite the contrary. They're just as driven, if not more so, than their more competitive counterparts. They simply channel their energy differently. Instead of trying to outdo others, they strive to outdo themselves. They constantly seek to improve, to learn, to grow, but on their own terms. Sigma males understand that life isn't a race, it's a journey. A journey that's unique to each individual. And they're not interested in taking shortcuts or stepping on others to get ahead. They're more interested in taking the scenic route, taking the time to learn, grow and enjoy the journey. They're not in a hurry to reach the finish line because they know that the real value lies in the journey, not the destination. What's more, Sigma males are not threatened by the success of others. They don't see others as rivals or competitors, but as fellow travelers on the journey of life. They're happy to celebrate the success of others without feeling diminished or threatened. Because for them, success is not a zero-sum game. There's enough for everyone. So while the rest of the world is busy competing, Sigma males are quietly doing their own thing marching to their own beat. They're not interested in proving anything to anyone. They're focused on being the best version of themselves. For Sigma males, the only competition is with themselves. 
Fifth on our list is Sigma Male's disregard for social norms. In the grand tapestry of human interaction, social norms are the threads that weave us together. They dictate how we should act, what we should say, and even how we should think. But Sigma Males, those enigmatic lone wolves of society, choose to snip these threads, embracing a radical form of individualism that sets them apart from the pack. Sigma Males are not rebels without a cause. They don't disregard social norms out of spite or for the thrill of rebellion. Instead, they are guided by a deep-seated belief in the value of authenticity and individuality. They reject the idea that they should conform to societal expectations simply because that's how things are done. For Sigma males, the question isn't what will people think, but is this true to who I am? They prioritize self-fulfillment over societal approval, valuing their personal principles above the transient trends of social norms. They're not interested in fitting into a mold, but in being the best version of themselves they can be. This isn't to say that Sigma males are anti-social or lack respect for others. Quite the contrary, they value genuine connections and treat others with regard. But they refuse to compromise their individuality for the sake of social acceptance. They understand that their worth isn't determined by how well they conform to societal standards, but by their own personal values and actions. So they march to the beat of their own drum, unafraid of the dissonance it may create. They embrace their quirks, their passions, their eccentricities, knowing that these are what make them unique. They revel in their individuality, unapologetically themselves, in a world that often pressures us to be anything but. In a world where we're often told to fit in, to conform, to blend, Sigma males stand as a powerful reminder that it's okay to be different. That it's more than okay, it's essential because it's our differences, our individuality, that make us who we are. Sigma males live by their own rules, not by societies. Sigma males are deep thinkers. This isn't just a casual claim, it's a defining trait that sets them apart. They are often seen as enigmatic, not because they are intentionally mysterious, but because they are absorbed in a world that many fail to see, the world of their thoughts. Sigma males relish intellectual stimulation. They are drawn to complex puzzles, intricate ideas and profound philosophies. Their curiosity is insatiable, their thirst for knowledge unquenchable. They are not merely content with surface-level understanding. They delve deep, dissecting information, seeking out the core, the essence, the truth. They revel in the richness of details, the subtleties that others might overlook. Their minds are always at work, exploring, analyzing, synthesizing. They are introspective, often spending time in self-reflection, examining their thoughts, emotions, and responses. They ponder on the mysteries of life, the intricacies of existence, the ebb and flow of the world around them. Sigma males are often lost in their thoughts, but not in a disoriented way. It's more like a deliberate dive into the depths of their minds, where they navigate the labyrinth of ideas with ease. They can be engrossed in thought, even in the midst of chaos, finding solace in the silent dialogue within. Their love for deep thinking is not a solitary pursuit. They value meaningful conversations that stimulate the mind. They appreciate those who can challenge their ideas, introduce them to new perspectives, and engage in intellectual sparring. They are not interested in idle chatter or superficial talks. They yearn for discussions that are thought-provoking, insightful, and enriching. For Sigma males, thinking deeply is not just about intellectual satisfaction. It's about understanding the world, making sense of experiences and finding purpose. It's about nurturing their minds, honing their intellect and cultivating wisdom. Sigma males are deep thinkers and they wouldn't have it any other way. They're not merely observers of the world. They are contemplators, ponderers, philosophers in their own right. Their minds are an unending source of fascination, a wellspring of ideas, a treasure trove of insights. For Sigma males, the mind is the greatest playground. Independence is a key trait of Sigma males. This statement is as accurate as it is profound. To understand Sigma males, you must first grasp the weight they place on independence. They hold this trait in the highest regard, often shaping their lives around it. 
Sigma males are not just independent in their actions, but in their thinking as well. Independence for them is not merely about doing things solo, it's about being comfortable in their own skin, relying on their own abilities and trusting their own judgment. They are self-reliant individuals who don't lean on others for validation or support. They thrive in their own company, finding solace in their solitude. This isn't to say they are antisocial or asocial, rather they simply prefer to chart their own course, navigate their own ship and be the masters of their own fate. They take pride in their ability to stand alone, making decisions independently and solving problems without seeking external aid. This independence is not born out of arrogance or a sense of superiority, rather it is a manifestation of their belief in self-sufficiency. They prefer to rely on themselves because they value their freedom and autonomy. They are not shackled by societal expectations or norms, and they don't feel the need to conform to the trends of the crowd. Sigma males are comfortable being their own person. They have a strong sense of self and are at peace with who they are. They don't seek approval and they don't need others to define their worth. They are content in their independence, embracing it as a vital part of their identity. This independence does not isolate them, but rather it liberates them. It gives them the freedom to live life on their own terms, to explore their passions and to pursue their dreams without being influenced by external pressures. Sigma males, in essence, are lone wolves, they roam the wild, not as outcasts, but as independent entities, content in their solitude, thriving in their independence and reveling in their freedom. They are comfortable in their skin, content in their solitude, and they wouldn't have it any other way. Last but not least, Sigma males are unpredictable. This trait is not born out of capriciousness or whimsy, but rather their staunch non-conformity. They dance to the beat of their own drum, refusing to follow the well-trodden paths laid out by society. Unpredictability in Sigma males is a natural consequence of their independent spirit. They don't subscribe to societal norms or expectations, and this often leads to actions that may surprise or even confound others. They might choose to embark on a spontaneous solo trip or take up an unconventional hobby. Their decisions are not made to shock or rebel, but because they're driven by their own unique interests and passions. This unpredictability adds an intriguing layer to the Sigma male's personality. It keeps those around them guessing, adding an element of mystery and intrigue. So remember, when dealing with Sigma males, always be prepared to expect the unexpected. So there we have it, the eight uncommon things only Sigma males like. In our journey through the road less traveled, we've unveiled the enigma that is the Sigma male. These unique individuals prefer solitude over social gatherings, leading a minimalist lifestyle that allows them to focus on what truly matters to them. They are autodidacts, self-taught and self-driven, with a non-competitive nature that sets them apart in our often cutthroat society. Their disregard for social norms isn't a rebellion, but rather a testament to their intrinsic independence. They are deep thinkers, often lost in their own worlds, and their unpredictability keeps those around them on their toes. These traits may seem uncommon, even strange to some, but they are the essence of Sigma males. Their uniqueness is not a flaw to be corrected, but a strength to be understood and appreciated. In understanding these uncommon things, we get a glimpse into the enigmatic world of Sigma males. 